today's video is a vehicle sale. So a lot of you have always been asking, when's the Nissan going for sale? I'm interested, I want to buy it. YouTubers, welcome back to another video at GDB Rescue and Recovery. Today's video is a vehicle sale. So, a lot of you have always been asking, when's the Nissan going for sale? I'm interested, I want to buy it. Um, you know, it's such a, a, a great tool, it's a powerful tool with the repo spec. Um, but, how can I word it? It's not for sale. It's the DAF, it's the DAF Accident Unit 18. It is an absolute phenomenal beast, but business circumstances have changed and at present that vehicle is up for sale. So let me give you a little tour, come with me. Okay, so this is it, the moment that some of you have been waiting for. This is the DAF CF65 model. This is an 18 ton vehicle that weighs just over 10 and a half tons. So you've basically got seven and a bit ton payload capacity on the back of the bed. The vehicle caters for all types of vehicles, cars, vans, uh, extra long wheelbase sprinters, your jumbo transit, motorhomes. You know, you'll see plenty of videos on the YouTube channel of what this vehicle can carry. It's a fantastic bit of kit. The big, big, big advantages with this, with, 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 with this DAF are one, it is a, I don't know where to start. There's so many good points about this truck. How about I just give you a little walk around? Uh, will that be easier? Answer is probably yes. So, we had it before me, had it for about 10 years. It was orange and blue, as you'll see on some of the old YouTube videos. Uh, vehicle obviously has a major restoration on the cab, which has been resprayed white and green. It's obviously got brand new Bridgestone tyres on the front, probably about three months old, give or take. You've obviously got the Hiab, which is a Cormac Hiab with extremely good ratings. As hopefully you will see on there. <coughs> um, now, one massive advantage with this DAF is how low the bed is. I don't know if you can really compare much with me on here, but it's extremely low chassis on this. So it is absolutely phenomenal when you've got Luton vans, high top vans. You do not have to worry about any height restrictions whatsoever. I remember going back a, a little bit of time before this, I was viewing some other trucks and your beds are like proper high up in the air, as some of you might see with some of the ambulance um, vehicles that they use for their own, um, or maybe with the SLA beds, the trucks are so high off the ground. This is just so low, it is un unreal. Now uh, you've got good tyres all round. Um, it does also have a fresh MOT certificate with a clean bill of health. You've obviously got the spotlights on the back. Um, obviously, you've got new tail light lenses on the rear. You obviously have got tow bar attachment should you want to use it or if you've got the license to use it. And obviously, an air connection on the back as well. Uh, the body is about... I don't know how long ago the body is. It's on the YouTube channel. But brand new steel bed, uh, which is absolutely good as gold. Uh, traffic cone holder as well. Again, good tyres. Uh, recent air tanks just before I bought it, they were changed. You've obviously got the lockers on both sides. One on this side. Which carries all various bits of equipment in there. Quite deep, so very good. Moving along, as you can see, it is a very solid chassis underneath. Um, you have got your manual levers should your remote fail, um, but generally I just carry a spare set of batteries just in case it ever goes on a job. And again, it's where you switch it from your bed over to crane for the high ab. 24 volt connection on there should you have an Anderson socket and need to do a jump start. Uh, fairly recent batteries, I changed them as soon as I bought it. 
Um, the only one negative I say, the high ab leg does have a small weep, obviously it's soaking wet through because I've just cleaned the truck, but I'll put it around just to try and preserve any little bits of oil, but it's an absolute minor weep once in a blue moon. So realistically, that is a job that you should get done if you want to get the high ab certificate and use it on contract work. Uh, like I say, it was a pair of tyres on the front, brand new Bridgestones, absolutely good as gold. And you can see a little bit of the old paint just behind there. As you can see inside, very clean and tidy walking up the ladder uh so obviously two seats one driver one passenger uh for some reason there is no seat belts it's uh seat belt exempt uh very clean interior nice and tidy and obviously got the sunroof as well um, and that's kind of a little quick cheeky tour with it but like i say most important you've obviously got the lodar remote which controls the winch and controls the bed and on this side, you can also adjust the air on the back end. You can, number one, lower it all the way down. And then if you want to put it back up, so once you've either loaded your low vehicle um, or you've gone under a bridge, not that you need it, and then to reset it. That's it, just like so. Uh, very low mileage as well. Well, I'd say it's low mileage, 452,000 kilometers, which is about, in English terms, 280,000 miles. Um, so like I say, the, the good things with this truck, it really set it off from the rest. One, its condition is fantastic. Having a recent body restoration, the high ab and the cab, uh, really good as gold. It will see a new owner through for a long, long period of time. Also benefiting, like I say, You've got the remote control system on the bed, out and in, and the hydraulic winch. And you've also got the air suspension on the back. And being this particular DAF CF65 model is a low sitting chassis, which is just absolutely brilliant. You very, very, very rarely need to use a measuring height stick because it just sits so low to the ground. Um, that's about it on the outside. I think I've covered most of those bits. A lot of you are gonna be thinking, what price? Well, how much is it, Greg? How much is it? Well, I'll get to that bit a little bit shortly. So. What I'm going to do now for you is get the high about and just show you with it lifting a vehicle with the spreader bar, which is included. So all lifting gear with this vehicle is included. So if you do get a job on your way home, you can do the job on your way home. Right, let's get the high about. First things first, get the engine on. Okay, so small interruption, news break, news break, news break. Uh, merchandise, the hoodies, DDB Rescue and Recovery are now available on the website, www.gdbrescueandrecovery.co.uk forward slash shop. There is a limited quantity available, so pause the video, get yourself on the website, get your orders in. Thank you very much. Okay, got my PPE on, let's get it on.
Right, that's us set up on the spread of art. Now time to get it up in the air. That's the Audi all loaded up on the spreader bar. Now time to get it up in the air before the storm kicks in. Right, that's the Audi A1 unloaded. Hopefully you enjoyed the video. The price of this vehicle is going up on the market at 20. If you do like what you see on the channel, like and subscribe.
So YouTubers, that is your little tour of the DAF CF 65 18 ton with the Cormac Kyobo Cray. Hopefully you enjoyed the video. The price for this vehicle is going to be fixed. I have seen lots of other vehicles on the market and nothing to be quite honest compares for this for value for money. If you don't like it, you know, thanks for watching this far on the video. I want £25,000. This vehicle is owned personally by me. It benefits from a new clutch, brand new MOT, the new tyres, the new bed, the air suspension, the beacons, the strobes, the lights, load our remote on the bed. Uh, like I say, you've got an absolute massive carrying capacity on the back. It's a, a fantastic tool. It's 25 grand. There's no VAT. That's it. The truck's there ready to rock. Comes with all equipment, all the straps, the lifts, ratchet straps, snatch blocks. Absolutely everything in there. That's the truck. If you want it, give me a call. You know, my number's on the side of the truck. If you don't know what it is, here it is. Appreciate you all for watching. Like I said, there were going to be a few changes uh, into the new year and this is one of them. So thanks for watching and stay tuned for what happens next. Bye for now. Yay!